Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Insane Stories coming at y'all with another video, man. Now you see better title. Most of my story times so far have been like, you know, not really depressing type uh, story times, but I know I do got some sad story times, as you guys can see by the title, okay? Um, especially living in Chicago, I'm sure everybody has a friend, you know, family member, <laughs> a dog, you know. You know, anything, a pet, you know, somebody that's dead because it's really hard out here for people. And uh, it's really sad, you know. But you got, yeah, so, I mean, what can I say? I have about, like, I have about five, six friends that's dead. So, five or six friends that's dead. I probably, like, only one girl and then the rest are. Uh, guys so, so like from from like shootings to I mean natural causes so but this the girl I'm gonna tell you about right now is she died from like I don't know if not not natural causes but she didn't die from somebody taking her life should I say but before I get into the video you guys you guys know what to do hit the like button for me we're gonna get straight into the video. So you guys, check this out. Okay, this girl I have met, we was friends in high school. And um we was like real friends. Um the girl, one of my ex I used to talk to in high school, her that was, they were friends. You know, so I know this is kinda wrong, but it's life. So me after me and my ex broke up, like during school time, during the summer, I started talking to. Her. I didn't start talking to her. She was talking. The girl that died. She was talking to my friend, and me and my friend we like stopped talking because like over her and over some other stuff. So you know, I I was like, you know, I don't want to be cool with you no more. So we we not friends anymore. She used to come to me about like problems with they used to have and things like that. So I'd be like, you know. You shouldn't be with, you know, somebody like that then. So, I mean, if he, he used to, like, talk about her a lot. How you gonna talk about somebody that you're, you're with? You wanna, you know, ask her to be your girlfriend. Now that she your girlfriend, you wanna talk about her like a dog. So, that's why I was like, you know, I was helping her out, cheering her up and stuff. So, I mean, I had, she was, like, really hurt one night. And I had drove to her house. And I came to see her. And then, like, to, like, comfort her and stuff like that. I didn't, like, get it. I didn't want it to. I didn't make it, like, how can I say this, you guys? I didn't, like, what happened, I didn't look forward to that happening, okay? Just, that's all I'm saying. But it happened. So, I mean, one thing led to another at that time because I comforted her after they had just broke up. So, and I had comforted her, like, and then one thing led to another, you know, we end up like having sex and stuff like that. I don't know if it's wrong or not, you guys. You guys could tell me if that's wrong on my part, you know, or not, because I don't know. We end up like start to be like, we ended up being like friends with benefits. And like friends with benefits, we end up start doing that. And then we started having problems, me and her. And then like, we started like arguing and stuff. One night we had argued and we came to agreement, a disagreement about something. And then like, we stopped talking like we used to, you know. And then she had met this guy that she used to talk to. I mean, not used to talk to, but that she started talking to. And he was from the, the uh, army and stuff. So she met him. So he had like, he had be like, uh, he had come back and forth just to see her and things like that. And then, they end up, he end up getting her pregnant. And when he got pregnant, you know, we definitely didn't talk then because, I mean, she started, I don't know if she started acting different, but our relationship towards each other was different, you know. But I feel like, I've just felt like she started acting different, you know, towards me. And it's not like, I'm not like talking about her, you know, especially since she's, she's a deceased. So I'm definitely, I'm now talking about her, but... I, that's how I feel. I feel like, you know, she had started acting differently on me. First, she was pregnant. So, she was pregnant, and uh, we had stopped talking, like, the beginning of her pregnancy. 
And then towards the end of her pregnancy, we still didn't talk. So, like, a long time we didn't talk. So, um, she was having a girl. And then the night she went to the, um, she was having her baby, she had went to the doctor. And she didn't make it. They, the baby came out, you know, alive. and But the baby just going to grow up without a mother because she didn't make it. She died having her baby. I don't know what it, like, how. You guys, somebody can explain to me, like, what the cost was so I don't know how like I don't know how she died you know having her, her having her baby I know she used to have like breathing plot problems like we used to um like sometimes when I see her sleep she'd like be like breathing a certain way and stuff like that so I knew like you know something was going on with her breathing and plus like she was she was telling me that she was gonna get like surgery on like her something in her throat or something her lungs or something she was getting surgery on but she never got the surgery because she ended up having a baby and she ended up dying so it was like really sad i still got on snapchat and i like like yes yeah it's really sad so that's my first friend it's part one of well you know friends dying and stuff you guys so that's the story uh it's really sad and, you know i wish i did like fix the relationship with us but I mean you know things have for a reason when my mom even passed we was the night she passed I was you know upset with her and stuff like that so I mean nothing hurts worse than that when you can't apologize and you know when it's too late so you guys when you more of the story if you upset with somebody don't just let the things you know go past because you never know if you're gonna see this person again you know you never know if God's calling them home or anything like that so you guys, um, that's the story, though, you guys. There'll be more coming on the way. If you guys like the video, please make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment if you're new, and comment what I can fix, you know, do better, and comment what you think of the video, you know. I like your opinion matters. But it has me a boy insane stories, and I'm out, you guys. Peace.